And when you think about rodeos, right off the back, the first things that come to your mind are horses, rodeo clowns, and the bull riders, of course. But often you overlook the most important people there. Well, now it's time the bullfighters get a moment to shine for their incredible and demanding job they have to do every night. They are the unsung heroes of the rodeo, saving lives while putting theirs on the line. They are the first responders for bull riders across the country. And to them, this is a passion. And more simply put, their duty. We're just here to um, protect those bull riders, um, put ourselves in the best, the best position to where they don't get hooked, I don't get hooked, and she, everybody walks off happy and on to the next one. These guys are rodeo superheroes. In a blink of an eye, any bull ride can go from good to catastrophic. And it's all on the bullfighters to save the day. So you gotta think, everybody's watching us. And, but you don't think about that, you know? You just do your job, get in there, and if you have to take a hook and you will, or whatever, hang up, jump up there to get them undone. But uh, you just really don't think about all that. As brave and courageous as these guys are, and standing two feet away from a 1,500 pound beast ready to pounce, they still feel the nerves before every ride. But it's keeping those nerves in check that will keep them calm and ready to do their job. You know, everyone's different, you know, and it never really leaves, you know, you always get that sense of nervousness, you know, and, you know, but if you learn how to control that, that's what really drives you, you know, to, to do better and go out there and, and, you know, use it as a tool. You get here, you know, you see the bulls and you know which, one are, which ones are going to be mean. And you, when it comes to bull riding, you just put that aside as best you can and, and just do your job. But remember, Jamie and Dakota wouldn't trade this job for the world. They grew up around rodeos all their lives. And as risky and dangerous as this job can be, they wouldn't have it any other way. Yeah, you know, you just got a passion for it and love what I do. And, you know, it's just, you know, want to do it till as long as I can. So. so next time you walk past a bullfighter at your local rodeo, tip your hat and tell them thank you.